Hello and welcome, welcome to Project Hospital, welcome to Doodlebug and welcome to the channel. Yes, today we are going to try our hands at Project Hospital. What do I know about it? I know absolutely hardly anything about it. Um, so against Two Point Hospital and this a complete difference. So um, we're going to bang ourselves straight in here. This has got groovy music. We're going to get on there. And we're going to help people and hopefully make or design the best hospital that we can actually do. Welcome back, welcome back. So, we are here. This is our 96 by 96. Um, got a nice little car park area here. We've got some sort of drop-off area here. Um, not too sure what that actually is at the moment. I haven't come across that. Um, but we've got loads of different departments down the bottom here, as you can see. Um, pathology, we've got right down to the... Um, MRI, we've got sexual health, we've got loads of different departments down here. Um, we're going to start with obviously the clinic. The clinic is the first thing that we do need to complete. Um, it's the, where the main waiting room is, the reception room and the doctor's office. Um, clinic, GP, same sort of thing. So I haven't got, I haven't really got an idea of how I'm going to do this yet, but I know I do want the entrance to be in the corner um so actually come to think of it but i can't change it now can i no can i delete it no but if i go there how much money do we start on hundred thousand i think it was right let's just Right, okay. Dynamite. Aha! Right. I'm going to have a path going out here first, I think. Path around the little car park. There you go. Right, so we've got a car park there. It's only small. Um, and then now we can actually start the foundations from here. So, 3 by 25. So, let's make that a bit bigger. There you go. So, this is going to be the starting area. This is going to come out here. And then from here, it's going to come along to that area there. Excellent. Right, so this is going to be our first little clinic. Um, I'm not going to use prefabs for everything, but I will start using some for areas that we need. Right, let's do this here. Excellent. Uh, let's put some doors in. I like the big sliding doors. One now. And one there. Um, that can be for the minute. I'm going to change the walls as well. I want to put some white walls in. So all this down here needs to be changed to white. Excellent. Right. So this is going to be the car park. And then obviously the main entrance is going to be there. But I want to, if I can... Try and see what's on a prefab. So we've got a waiting room here, corridor. Right, I'm going to use this first of all. But I am going to uh, not use prefabs. But at the moment, I'm going to prefab, sorry. I'm going to actually uh, just use it to get reception up and going. Um, so we need some doctor's offices. I think they're going to be good going along there. So... Um, Let's put that in line with that. So they come in, and then you've got that there. We've got a waiting room as well. That can be next to it. We can change. Let's delete this one. We can move this one around.
There I go. Actually, can I put one there? Yes, I can. And that one we can get rid of. So we've got the reception area here. And then we've got a little waiting area there. So we need the doctors. Uh, the corridor is going to be down here. But we need a doctor's area. So a doctor's 4x6. Quite a small place. But it will suit us. So... Obviously on here you have day shifts and night shifts. You've got loads of different days and nights. Um, I thought, I mean I haven't played this. I ha I've had the game for quite some time. I've just never actually pl played it the way it should be. Um, I never even bothered doing it. So it's quite good for me to get on the game and see how good it actually is. Right, so... We've got a common room that we will need to put in. Actually, that could go there. Right, excellent. So we've got our doctor's area here, waiting room, and that. Let's just get to the management. So we have got, from what I know, that's the reception, and that's the one at night. Doctor... Hospital now accepts patients, excellent, and then we can have a night doctor as well, so we are 24-7 hospital now. Um, we're going to have days, are probably going to be busier. So that is good, we need a cleaner, and we need one at night. That is the staff room, and they call it the common room. Uh, right, let's have a look quickly at... That, we need a corridor, don't we? So, this here is going to be the corridor. Excellent. And the corridor down to here. Nice, big, wide corridors. Right, how much are we on? We're on 14,000, so we're going to leave it there for a minute. Um... At the moment, at the beginning of this game, that what's the doctors doing there? Hmm? Well, that's weird. I haven't seen that before. So it's like stuck on the tables. Can I pick them up? Select department, dismiss, add employer to favourites. Right, let's speed it up. Ah, oh, that's alright, they've come out. That's good, that's good. Right, so at the moment, we've got to treat one patient per day at the emergency. That's it. I'll, I'll turn the music up a bit so you can hear it. I quite like the music on here. So we are doing the patient now. Patient is with the doctor. We've got three patients here. Yay! Objective complete. Excellent. Get in there. We are... See, we didn't have to go to university to learn about doctors and stuff like that and the medical. We can know ourselves. So, insurance company. So, on here, it's a little bit different. See, you've got some insurance stuff. So we've got 32 contracted um, and at the moment we have just opened this one here cheap o care so that is good it does get harder so as you can see the doctors come out and call the patient now there is something and you're gonna have to bear with me it's around here somewhere that actually is part of a mod that I added um can never bloody find it but it is here somewhere uh coffee vent no 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 where is it so basically it's a queue line and what they do info tv you need one of them up
and they push a button and they call people in there is a queue line so we're going to put that there and we should have another machine that lets them know where stuff is let me have a quick look and see if we can find it quickly there is info point so it's that one there excellent what we're gonna do is we're gonna put that over there excellent so now after this one they should when the new patients come in now they should take a ticket and they get called on the telly so for some reason it's not part of the game it had to be modded to make it work but at least we've actually we've got that I wish you waste loads of times the doctors coming up getting the patients and taking them back again so he's got a ticket wait there and then obviously gets called so off he goes much easier than obviously waiting and stuff like that So if we click down here, we can see where we are. Cleaning, everything's all good at the moment. Setup value is medium. A lot of the stuff I don't really know what it's all about, but um, we've got a lot of departments. You can build up to about 10 floors, I think, in the hospital. Um, but there's a mod that you can build much quicker as well, like higher. So that's just pretty good, pretty good. So I hope you guys are doing well. Actually, I, I haven't even said, have I? I mean, I haven't uploaded for about four or five weeks. And I have been getting the messages. Um, but I was not in the country. I was in Portugal. So, but I'm, I'm back now. I've had a break. I'm back to work next week. So, obviously, I've got this week off. And I'm going to start today, tomorrow, over the weekend. Start banging out some videos. Um, because it's needed. He's having, he's having a break. Oh, oh, actually, no. Jane only went in to get some water. Ding, ding. Right, and then they will go and do that. It's pissing hard outside by the looks of it. Completely different in the UK today, actually, because today it's at about 26 Celsius, 27 Celsius out there. Blue sky and full sun. It's absolutely gorgeous out there. And to be fair, it has been since I come back from Portugal on Monday. Um been pretty good right so we've got this main bit here we're gonna speed it up going well we've got the visiting hours between eight and six staff lunch is one till two uh, the clinics open midnight till obviously uh, midday to midnight you can change all the stuff if you want to um, but I'm not going to bother that. Right, there's no clear diagnosis. The initial workup of the patient has not revealed a diagnosis. Consider hospitalizing the patient or transferring them to a different department to continue investigation. Right, so as, let's just slow it down quickly. As you can see here now, they want me to try and open up an open radiology, radiology clinic. I can't say a lot of these medical words. It really does fuck me off. Um, so this is what we need to unload, uh, unload, to load that sort of room up. Um, it takes a lot, takes a lot of money as well. We've only got 35 at the moment, so. Um, I did ideally, I could make my own one. So you've got the prefabs here that are just standard rooms, so it saves you design them. Or you can design them yourself now. Quite like the idea of designing it myself. Hospitize. I mean when she said when he said it it's gotta be hospitize, I would imagine that that is a um bed mm, right we'll keep playing it at the moment and then um, we'll build up some money because 
We've only got nearly 36,000 at the moment. We're coming to four o'clock, or well, nearly five o'clock now on day one. It's been a very successful day, I have to admit. Looking good. Um, what we probably could do with is some plants dotted about the place. Probably look quite nice. Clock, so they know how long they've been waiting. Uh, some COVID signs, because you can't get enough of COVID. Put it behind the plant, so people can't read it. Floor lamp. Excellent. Right, let's lower that down. Right, they're all in there having a chat. Everyone's in the staff room. The most busiest area, and it's definitely going to have to be the staff room. So we've had one treated patients, or untreated, and we've had nine treated patients at the moment. Ten in total. Um... Clinic's open from midnight, so we've got about four hours until it's actually opened again. Um, don't want bank loans at the moment. It's getting night, obviously. Um, and obviously it opens at night. There is, I've got literally little staff actually on night shift. Um, but, I mean, that's all you really need, to be fair. So you've got two idle rooms at the moment. And within, literally, couple, three hours or so, we should open up and it should all be good. We've got the reception there. We've got a doctor who surprisingly was having a tea break. It will get much busier as, as the time comes on. So we can straight till the morning. We've got the cleaner. So the cleaner's coming on night shift. Um... Right, excellent. So we've got 33, so we're actually losing money. It's holiday time. A lot of people are leaving the city, so 10 cent less patients arrive per day. Terrific. That's not what I want. A lot of people are on holidays. Terrific. Right, let's fast forward it. So we've got two in the morning. We will wait until the morning to stop it. And we'll see the difference then. Um, Project Hospital is, is very, very uh, in-depth. So much more in-depth than I thought actually the game is. Uh, right, so there's no clear diagnosis again. So hospitalising the patient or transferring them to a different department. So what we need to do there in that situation, we we need to try and um, we're definitely going to need to open another place. Um, can I open a pharmacy at the moment? Microlabs. Nurse station. Alright. Let's play it. We've we'll built some money up while we got it. That can stay there like that. That's going to be the ward eventually, but... Um, to be fair, I don't actually know what I'm doing, so... We need some money is what we need. We've got one person untreated at the moment. We are getting some visitors in though. 
and they're not waiting that long either, so the turnaround's quite quick. That's good. Got 3,000 government grant there as a reward. Treat 10 patients per day. We should be able to do that, actually. Alright, come on. Love the hospital. Come on. It's a lovely place to be. That's what they told me, anyway. Come on, that's it. Get on it, mate. Get on it. He's loving it. Sixteen patients in total. It's quite in depth though when you look when you look, it's quite um you know the animations and stuff, it's pretty good. Just clean us out, cleaning the bits and bobs. It's good. I do like the music in the game though, I must admit, I do like the game. The music! Right, come on! It's all about the dosh, that's the problem. We're only on day two. But so far, it, it, looks, it looks quite good. Obviously there is, there is ambulances you can put in as well. Um, Got the emergency, but I think it's down here somewhere. There's ambulances you can add, you can add. Not sure where they are now, but ah, pharmacy, hospital pharmacy sells medicine to your patients. Ah, right, okay. That is what we need. We need a pharmacy. Got anywhere to put it now? Right. Tell you what, I'm going to get rid of this, but I'm going to put the pharmacy in there. Right, where's the bloody door up there? Excellent. So, I believe that needs a nurse, and then you need a nurse for night shift. Right, so now we can sell medicine. So that's good. If we need medicine, we can subscribe it and sell it to them. She's flicking her head. Look, she's loving it. She's got a bit of a twitch, actually. She's in the right place if she needs some medicine. Another twitch on her. Oh, she's off. Oh. Now she looks like she's shagging the sofa. What the fuck is all that about? <laughs> You're terrific. Right. Okay, so we, we will do a ward. I'll probably add it over here somewhere. Um, but we've got the pharmacy. What else is there? I haven't really looked at this. So we've got a gift shop. Okay. Service office. What's that? This room allows you to hire a manager who increases the overall efficiency of all janitors in the hospital and allows you to assign them to clean individual rooms. Okay. Oh, a calf. Now that's good. That's what you need. Cafeteria, employees, canteen, place to eat proper meals. And you've got a study room as well. What's this? Templates of Path Lodge I can't say any of these, so. Cold rooms can safely hold dead bodies. That's good to know. Common room cleaning, on call, on call. Oh, right, okay, so we have got the on call. All doctors needed for running the department are based in here. On call. Do we actually need it at the moment? I don't think we do, do we? Nurse station. We do need a nurse station. What's this one? What's this? Whatever that says. Right, so you've got ears, nose and throat. You've got modern ear. Ear, nose. Diagnostic unit. Operating room. Audiogram. 
regular ward. Here we go. We've got wards now. Oh, excellent. So we're going to get the ward that we want. Oh, there you go. Missing staff. I do need to order another nurse, I think. So, who was waiting? Someone was waiting. Now we've got a area that we could do. We work overload. No, yeah, no worries about that. What I do want to... I need to put the corridor in. Corridor. I want to make that a corridor. Excellent. Might put a small toilet here. Um, I mean, we have got one there. Right. Missing equipment, workload, day, none, or night. Right, so I need to... It's missing equipment. What's it missing then? I'm not sure what that's missing. Workload, day, none, workload, night, none. I'm not by complete insurance companies. Okay, do I need to... Insurance companies is reached. Free of free. Okay. So, treat 20 patients. Create one doctor. Liver, TY, open clinic at a specialised department. Okay, so I've got I've got to wait till I finish that, I think. But we have got a ward there. We've got 13,000. Patients number and insurance payments are back to normal. I thank God for that. Hopefully we'll get some more patients in. So we've got the nurse that's on call. We've also got a ward, so that's good. Um, I don't think it's operational at the moment, though, so I'm not sure how you do that. And I can't, I don't think. Normal mode, hazards. Okay, I'm not sure what that's all about. Workload is low. The workload there is medium. Okay, so we're just... It's on its fastest speed, so... Let's go through and see what we can... How much money we can make. Insurance care. Insurance company Medicare can be contracted to send patients. Oh, is that what that is? So, it sends you patients. So, Medicare. Um, departments. Insurance companies. Ambulance. Budget. So, Medicare. There you go. Right. So they send, so it's basically them sending customers to me. And everything else is locked at the moment. But our money should increase now because we've got them extra, the other extra insurance company, so. I would like that to open if we could. So let's. Oh, we can't. 
I don't even know if we actually needed a drugs area. I don't think we actually did, to be fair, but... Um, we've got one now, anyway. Oh, here we go. Are these waiting for someone to come in there? Oh, the bloody nerds. Come on, mate. Get going, bloody woman. Is it next question, please? Let's go. Look at the animation there. Looks quite good. Yeah, we made 220 just out of that one person. Bloody hell, that's expensive tablets. So that will help towards our our money there. Why are we queuing? Are they queuing to see reception? Oh, if it comes to it, we might have to hire someone else, but... As you can see, it, it does get very busy from what I've told. I mean, I've, I've gone no further than day two in this whole game. So, um, at the stage we are at the moment, it's the furthest I've been. We may have to... I might have to get some more doctors in. At the moment, I can't seem to do that. Can't seem to order any more staff. Seating areas fill up. Bloody hell, man. <laughs> okay, uh, that needs to be much bigger than that. At the moment, people have got nowhere to sit. But I need to order more doctors, but I can't get... Yeah, I know it's missing staff. That's what I'm trying to get hold of. why it's like so bloody small what's all that about staff table but I can't absolutely see anything on it okay I, I, I do need to try and Get it right so we we completed an objective treat 10 patients per day so we've got a thirty thousand grant get in there we're bloody rich now forty four thousand select a doctor i can't no hints in all patients your patients normal mode yeah I need to put some more seating in there eventually. It's good though, we're getting some more people in now, it's getting busier. Doing the pharmacy, this needs to be changed as well, but... Right, it wants me to put a radiophology in, so I need to... Um, put this in, there's a lot of areas I need to do for it though. Um, janitors, shared rooms, and then you've got the room singly. It's going to cost quite a bit of money, that. Ah, oh, here we go. It was because it was on the wrong button down there. So let's add more to that. We'll do a night one. Um, can I order another nurse? Reception. Got one person on days, one on nights. Okay. 
Oh, that'll do. Right, so it should go much quicker now because we've added another three doctors or another two doctors at least. Um, so that's going to help the waiting area. They've been cured. They need some tablets that they're going to go and get money for. That we are going to make as well, so that's good. Um, Radiologic clinic. I do need to do one of them, so I will have a look at that when I can. Uh, we've got five people waiting. I would like to... I would like to order a nurse if I can. Boom. Bam, bam. Um... Chief Doctor. Okay, so... Andrew Coleman is going to be the chief doctor. What I do need... I need to find out how to so get some more nurses. We need a couple more nurses involved. Objective, yes. Increase clin uh, clinic patients per day to 15. Excellent. It's going to help us... Make the hospital go a bit better. And the reputation obviously is going to be much, much better. Um, right. The only thing that is worrying me is trying to get more nurses in. Because the nurse isn't able. What about if I go to that and then go to that? No, it's not, it's not working, is it? That? Yes, 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 yes. There you go. We've got some extra persons in with that. So, that's two people now in the tablet area. So, one can go to break. And I've still got one there. And I've got one running on night shift. So, two in the day, one on nights. It's going to be more busier in the day, I'd imagine. So... That's why I've done that. Treat 20 patients. We've got 50,000 grant. Oh my god, people. Look at that. I'm nearly 100,000. Get in there, man. And I didn't go to university. It's amazing. Right, so. Because I could, I could connect that to that. And I can order them. Can one of these help me? Right, it's that one there. But I haven't got it unlocked yet, have I? That's why. So we could delete that, because it's useless for me at the moment. So we've got enough money now to start thinking about... Do we actually extend it and open it as a... Um, we open the radiology... Radiology clinic... It's going to be quite away from where we need to be but i think we should open one so let's start the building process it's going to be quite big well i say quite big but it's, it's going to be in this area here so they're going to come down there let's take the walls down from here Build the walls up from there. Excellent. Oh. Right. So it's a bit of a walk, but what I'm what I'm planning to do is I'm gonna move the reception to the left hand side. Or do I? I could make the reception bigger. Nah, nah. I'm going to leave it like that. So, around here. So this is going to be, you've got the prefabs, but x-ray room and all the other goody bits. But we've got what we need here, I think. So we need a waiting room. Um... Uh, let's actually let's just have a look at the prefabs a minute. Oh yes, look another grant. 
God, we lost a lot, we? Can we actually start any of the others or not? No. That's alright, we're not doing too bad at the moment. Uh, I've, I've just realised I've lost a lot because I, I did this tonight, so that would be the reason why. Um, right, so what, we, what I want to have a look at is this here. So we need an x-ray room. 8 by 6. Um, how much are they? Oh god, they're quite expensive. CT, MRI, yeah, that's going to be expensive as well, isn't it? Oh, my bloody hell, that, that's well expensive. Um, and a restroom. Excellent, 2,600. We need a reception area. Um... I don't even know if we if we do need it. Yeah, we need a waiting room and we need cardio, we need we need quite a bit of stuff. So let's fast forward it. get some money up again might need to take a bank loan out eventually but I wonder if we have to pay for the uh, the machines you'd think so wouldn't you but maybe not 36 patients we've done so far going pretty well we've got two in the pharmacy we started the radio so that's good. Right, we're going on to nights now. It's 8 o'clock. We're on day 3. We're just about to go to day 4. Oh my god, we've done it. we treated 30 patients per day. Absolutely brilliant. We are going quite well. Rooms with critical work overload. One. Oh, what's that in? Clinic. No idea. No idea what that is. Right, now we can get a bank loan. Um, daily interest, total loan. So we can... That's daily interest. Jesus Christ. Okay. Oh, fuck. No! Uh, have I just done that bank loan? Oh, bloody I have. Oh, fuck, thank fuck I can pay it back. I've got £621. I don't believe it. <laughs> right, guys, I'm going to leave it there. What I'm going to do is I'm going to um, simultaneously leave this on fast forward for, I don't know, until we get to day five, six, or seven. Um, so the next episode, hopefully, we're making money. So it just went up about three, four hundred pounds there. So we are making money. I'm going to leave it going till probably day eight, day eight maybe. Um, bad weather and low temperatures cause twenty percent more of your patients come to the clinic. Oh, okay. So that's good. So that's going to help with the money. We've got more people coming in. Um, have we got the infrastructure to cope with that? Who knows? We will find that out very, very soon. Um, but I'm going to simultaneously do this to day eight so I can build up my money. And then we shall spend some more in episode two. Thanks for joining me. If you like the video, then please give it a like. Please subscribe. Please share if you're that desperate. Um, until next time, I shall see you in a, another video. I shall see you very soon.